Welcome to my channel. My name's Emily and I do normally do homeschooling videos with my four-year-old daughter Rosie. Because of the current situation and the lockdown, all of her usual socialising stuff like gym, swimming, um, all that kind of stuff is on hiatus. So to try and keep some normalcy for her, I have been recreating Kelch on a Monday morning. Now it is Easter Monday, but Rosie does not understand that it would not be on. So we have still recreated Kelch. So I shall um, put in all the different stations I've set up in our very small living room. So even if you have a small area, this is an idea of how you can set it all up. Plus what we got up to a bit of yesterday and then the rest of our week with activities just, just to inspire any ideas of things you can do with your children. We don't homeschool all day and um, homeschoolers don't really like the term homeschool either because we home educate. We don't try and replicate school at home. So... Yes, anyway, I should get into the video. What's your name? Rosie. Laughed us doing the lockdown ice bucket challenge. Yeah. Yeah? Are you sure now, Bab? Go for it, Dad. Are you sure? Yes. Quick, don't do it slow. <laughs> <laughs> Who did you nominate, baby? Someone else has to do that. Whoever you nominate has to do that. Daddy. Daddy, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Who else? Two more people. Bethan. Bethan and? Harry. Harry. So Daddy, Bethan and Harry have been nominated for the next one and I'm about to do mine in a minute. Uh, yeah. Almost. Put an egg tot into the bunny head. Try again, Babs. One more time. Good shot, you! Nope, too far. And wrong direction. Rosie is into drawing at the moment. She's currently having her breakfast. I've created her this book where out of each letter of the le alphabet, uppercase, I've created a character and then Rosie's going to name it, try and copy it and then in a different colour pen she's going to trace over where the letter is. So this one's got an A in it, this one's got a B in it and Rosie's already named Harold and Pregnant Betty and then she's going to do the same thing find the C. So they're all in order. They're in alphabetical order D. And Rosie's going to try and copy the picture and then in a different colour pen to black at least she's going to try and go over the no. the letter. And she can name them if she wants. So D, E, F, G, H. Some of them are quite obvious, some of them are a bit more tricky. So hopefully she'll enjoy. Good job.
and can see how even through your child's play um, they're still learning we don't normally think of life in subjects like I've broken it down um, some weeks we do baking other weeks Rosie has helped in the garden with some painting gardening all sorts of different things so um, everything is wide and broad I just thought I'd make this video with broken into subjects again just so anybody who's just found us um, can see how everyday play can turn into um, lots lots of subjects covered basically so we hope how are you uh, coping with the, the lockdown feel free to comment below if you want to have a chat um, Rosie is still playing with her shadow theatre right now so uh, it is not as nice today so we may end up resorting to a movie but for now it's a tough beat and a tough from the Rosie Bear